This is the Canon PowerShot Zoom. It's a 1.2 megapixel camera. It has a focal length of 100 to 400, that's a 35 millimeter equivalent, and a digital zoom of 800. It shoots HD video and JPEG pictures, and it has optical stabilization and a really nice color high-res viewfinder. And you can send the images and the video through Wi-Fi or Bluetooth to your phone. Now this is kind of a, a neat little thing to uh, bring out with you on the water or if you're fishing because it's instead of having a pair of binoculars which could be a little heavy and cumbersome this little thing is kind of small fits in your pocket uh, and you can see a pretty good distance. Now I like a lot of things about this uh, little guy but there's also a lot of things I don't like about it. So here's what I like about it. It's small, it's lightweight, it powers on quickly, it's easy to transfer images and video to your phone. It's got a great color viewfinder. It's great for capturing images that you really can't get on your cell phone. I like it for spotting birds on the horizon. And the cool thing is when you see something that's cool, you can either take a picture of it or shoot video of it. And that's something that you can't do with a set of binoculars. It's also cool if you're fighting a fish like a, uh, a bluefish and you can capture that fish jumping. That's again, something you really can't do with a, with a GoPro or, a, or your cell phone. But with this thing, you can get pretty close. But I will warn you, you're not gonna get the same results you would with a big DSLR with a big lens. But you're giving up the weight and the convenience of it. Those are the things I like about it. Now, let me tell you what I don't like about it. Here's what I don't like. It's not even weather resistant. You gotta be really careful out this year. If you're gonna be using this in a marine environment or on the beach, I have a feeling it's not gonna hold up well. So if you do buy it, make sure you get the insurance. It doesn't even come with a protective cap for the lens or the eyepiece. I mean, it's $300. It should come with something like that. The image quality is adequate, but not great. Again, it's not going to compare with a big DSLR lens, but it is lightweight and you can just drop it in your pocket. One of the things that's really missing on this is a tripod mount that you normally see on a camera on the bottom. So if you wanted to put it on a tripod, you could mount it and you could leave it stationary. It doesn't have that. How come? I really don't think it's worth the 300 bucks, but you know, I will say I am having fun with it. I have it now, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of liking it, but uh, knowing the limitations on it, I'm not really sure if I would buy it again, but I, I am enjoying it. I hope you liked the quick review of the Canon PowerShot Zoom. Give me a thumbs up if you like it, a thumbs down if you don't, and let me know if you have questions, leave it in the description below.